This is my first time doing a package opening. I watch a lot of these on YouTube where people purchase things and then they open them so you guys can see it the same time as the buyer does. Uh, I bought these from two different sellers but they arrived on the same day and they do go together so it gives me a chance to do the review today. I've been waiting. I thought one would come and then the other wouldn't come for another month but Coincidentally enough, they both arrived on the first day. So this might be a little bit tricky. Opening this, filming with one hand and cutting. What I might do is I might pause, open them up and then start it up again. Okay, we're back again. So I've just pulled them out of the wrapping. So it's still in the box and whatever's in here, which I think they're incense cones is still wrapped up in this little satchel so on facebook i play a lot of you know on there and each time you try to get more money they uh, play ads every now and again and half the ads are nothing but garbage but every so often you ask yourself did i just watch that and what this is it it, it is a ceramic backflow incense burner and i was amazed by what it actually did so i typed it in on youtube and I found a whole bunch of them, different styles, and I couldn't believe it. I'd never seen anything like it before, so I thought I'd buy one. And I bought one in the style of a waterfall, considering I do a lot of bushwalking, I love my waterfalls. So we'll open this up and see what it looks like in person. It looked nice on the eBay listing. I don't even know if it's in one piece, if it's broken in transit, how big it is. Oh, it's a tiny little thing. Okay, so there it is. It did come with 10 cones. And these ones here I bought separately. These are scented. So there's meant to be 10 different scents in there. Oh, look at the mess it's made already. Okay, so what this does, as you can see, I don't know if, it, if it's showing up too clear, but it's meant to be in the shape of a cascading waterfall. And up the top here, there's a small hole where you actually put these incense cones. I think there is another hole down here somewhere where you can actually put one of those incense sticks. But that's not what this is all about. I'm going to take one of these cones out, the scented ones. And I'll show you what they look like on the bottom. So as you can see there, on the bottom of the cone, there's a little hole. And apparently when... You light this cone, sit it up on top there, and you light this cone. Apparently it's meant to be a cascading waterfall of smoke. So it looked fantastic on the commercials, but let's see what it looks like in person. So I'll stick that up the top there, like that. Get our trusty lighter. Light her up without burning myself. It's hard to actually look through the camera. Okay. I think we've got it. Now the trick to these is also, you can't have any wind around. So if you've got windows open or aircon on, you've got to actually turn them off for this to work. I don't even know if it's going to work. Maybe they were doing some trick photography online. Oh, that stinks. <coughs> Nothing's happening just yet. It is burning. I can't see any cascading water. This might be a total flopperelli. It seems to be burning up. But it does have a hole in the bottom, so I'm wondering why it's not going down. Let's give it a little bit longer and see what happens. Maybe I should have tried this out before I started filming. <laughs> this is going to look very funny if it doesn't work.
Well, here we go. Can you see that? At the top of the waterfall there, let me see if it's focusing, there seems to be a little bit of smoke running down. I don't know if that's focusing or not. Ooh, it's running down a little bit. I don't even know if I've got enough light here. Maybe I should get one of my torches and actually shine the torch on. If it starts... Oh, look at that. It's working. I might go get one of my flashlights because there might not be a hell of a lot of light under here. I'm pretty much restricted in my unit where I can sit down and do stuff like this. The bowl, the base at the bottom is filling up like a little swimming hole. It is taking its time. But it does seem to be working a little bit. I'll just go get a torch actually and shine it on there just in case I don't have enough light on here. And we'll let it do its thing for a little bit. Okay, we've got a torch. And here we go. So it does make a huge difference if you actually get up out of your chair and cause a little movement, little wind, it doesn't like it. So these must have total I just have to sit somewhere totally where there's no wind and you've got to be careful not to put too much movement. But there you go. There's, there's smoke flowing down there. It's spreading out a little bit and it looks like one of those hot springs that you'd find in Japan somewhere. Look at that, it's actually flowing down the bottom and it looks like water, but it's just smoke. Wow, so it does actually work. The smell is incredible. Actually, I meant to have in there about 10 different types of scents and this pink one, I hope all the pink ones smell like this, because this smells absolutely beautiful. Now, I did buy one, not exactly like this, a lot taller one for a friend, a really cl close friend for Christmas. And would you believe it, I was just over at her place this um, <laughs> this weekend and she had it up on the windowsill. And she does love a few beverages on a Friday night. And she decided to open the windows. It was rather hot on Friday night. And would you believe it, the ceramic backflow incense, incense holder was up the top there and... Um, she cracked it into a million pieces. I never even got a chance to see it in action. Well, I've got my own now. And I know not to put it on the windowsill. Looks like a little lighthouse on the top there. With it flowing down. I don't know if it's doing it justice on the camera. But let me tell you, in, I'm looking under the cam camera here. And it looks absolutely beautiful. I'll bring it closer. Look at that. That looks fantastic. And it's actually flowing off the base of it. And you would think that the table would be soaking with water, but it's just smoke. That's all it is. They're meant to last about 10 to 15 minutes. And there's so many different styles. If you get on there, like I said, I, I bought this one because I love bushwalking and seeking out um, waterfalls in the bush. I think there's something awesome about, about running water and waterfalls that have existed for so long. But yeah, there's so many different types. So if you're interested in getting something like this, just remember you can't have any windows open, can't have the aircon on. You've got to have it in a spot where it's just totally still. That is brilliant. Look at that. Very impressive. Let me see if I can get a different angle. Can you see it all on the desk there? It looks like... Let me see if I can leave that there and run my finger through it. Yeah, it's just smoke. There's no fluid or anything. Oh, now it's going over the whole waterfall. Well, there you go. That's my very first box opening.
that I've ever done. Like I said, I watch a lot of these on YouTube and I thought I'd do one myself. So I'm pretty happy with this. I wasn't expecting too much, but the smell alone is absolutely beautiful and for it to actually work like it did on the commercial that I've seen, it's just a bonus. Until next time. Now I've set it up here in the kitchen. I'm going to actually print out a nice backdrop, maybe stick it up there on the blind and keep it up here. And I'll light up one last time. The first one worked really well. Let's see this one. This is a different type of cone. I'm not too sure. Some work better than the others. Let's see. Okay, so there's no wind here. The window is totally closed. It does take a little bit to get going, but once it does, it looks pretty spectacular. Well, it did in the room. Let's see. If you're ever looking for scented candles, the Palm Beach collection from the Boathouse Group, jasmine and lime scented, the best. The best I've ever come across. We've bought all different types. Some smell really nice in the shops. You get them at home and they don't smell at all. Okay, so it does take its time. Once you light it, it's probably about a minute or two in before you start seeing the effects. This video has been running now for about a minute 18 and there's still nothing coming down. I'll give it a quick pause and once I do see it running down the fall, I'll start it up again and let you know how long it took. Okay, that took about two and a half, three minutes. The hole that it comes out of is just to the left of that cone. So it spills out from there and it trickles down like a waterfall and it fills up the bottom there like a little hot spring. But it does definitely work. I do have the air con or a fan going right behind me in the distance but it doesn't seem to be affecting it over here. But it's a pretty impressive thing. It's working nicely. There it is coming off the end there. that's focusing or not. I'm not sure if the video does do it justice but in person it does look pretty spectacular. And this cone I've got on at the moment doesn't smell at all. So if you don't like incense or scented cones you don't have to buy them. I think there's odorless ones May, you might have a little touch of smoke from them, but um, I, I did see somewhere where you can buy non-scented cones. And they're like, meant to last about 10 to 15 minutes, so about two and a half, three minutes for this particular one to get going. And then you can have about 10 to 15 minutes of a nice scent running through your home. Okay, I think that'll do us. Adios.